Irish whip into their corner. Tags in. The Tommy Chong lays a kick right in the midsection. Now what's he got playing here? Oh, wait a minute. He's setting up for Boston Crab. Can we call it a Canadian Crab since Tommy Chong is Canadian? Nas nah, fighting out of it and does. Kicks him off. Nas, nah, I think, needs to go get the tag to his partner, Randy Hayes. Oh, nice drop toe hold. Chong didn't even see that coming. Oh, but Nas didn't see that foot in the face either. Locks him up in a headlock and pushes him out of the way. Didn't do anything. Irish whip. Oh, right hand, but Nas shook that off. Drops the hammer. Counters by Chong. Makes the tag to Cheech. Look at Nas, sends him into the corner with authority. My way and Cheech and Chong fighting to see who can survive. The loser of this match will be out of tag team turmoil. So it's very important to not only survive in this match, but make an impact. Because after, after showtime, some of the polls will be out on our fan page. So take a look at that as she slaps on the tail. What a crab. Nas trying to fight his way out of it and does. And now Nas finally makes a tag to his partner Randy Hayes and gets a cheap kick in before he leaves. Hayes has him in the front chancery, but Cheech counters to a clothesline of his own. Yes, indeed, as I said, some of the polls will be out after this show. So go to the fan page, speak your piece, and definitely vote on who will make on who you think should make it into these matches. Now I can guarantee you all polls will not be out. That's why I'm hearing from Don King. We'll find out more of that as, the, as time goes on. But right now, we got Mini Bellum here. It looks like, yes, it's Nas and Chong are the legal men. One headlock by Cheech. What's he got planned here? Oh, no. Uh, this isn't pretty. Now look at look at Chong just trash talking, but Nas gets some help from his partner and sends him over to the outside of the ring. One. Now all four men are outside. One. I did not think. Oh, what a, oh my God. Two. What a face buster by Hayes. Three. I do believe that Chong hit those stairs. He probably didn't. Four. But I would be definitely surprised if he did. Now. Drop to hold again by Nas. He's about to slap on a busted crab of his own. But Cheech Marin is not the legal man. This has gone wacky already. One. Now, Nas says Cheech to the outside. Then leaves the two legal men in this ring. Has him hooked. What is he about to do here? Nice suplex. By Nas. And that drops the elbow right across the jaw. Now, not, oh, the big man is going up top. Hot dogging for the crowd. And just saw Chong get out of the way. Well, I should say rolled out of the way. One. And sends him outside for his measure. But look at Cheech. Sneaking behind, big shot to the back, and more repeated shots. Three. Oh, drop kick. And now, what was what was Randy thinking? Now he's paying for that yop. 
As Nas gets back in the ring, and like he tripped and fell there. Not a good way to show an impact, fellas. Wait a minute! That's Lamont! Lamont! He's attacking Cheech! Lamont's gaining revenge for him and his father! Cheech trying to fight back! Back suplex by Lamont! Tommy Chong is not even aware of this! He's working over Nostradamus! And now, oh, now he sees him! Twice. Now he sees him as Lamont is redecorating that other announce table! Nas cuts Tommy Chong off! Oh, uh, what, what is Lamont do planning here? Three. Wait! Stunner! Sanford Stunner! Four. Sanford Stunner on Cheech as my way is working! Over Tommy Chong! Chong gets dropped on his back! He is the legal man! Another stunner! And now he just gets a shot in himself! And this has been Bellum! Lamont Sanford is working over Chase Bear. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, this is payback. A price cut on the floor. Two. Now, knocks him to the barricade and clotheslines him over it. Now, back in the ring. And Randy are working over Tommy Chong, who's now all alone. Oh, that modified backbreaker. Lamar Sanford has turned this match in the Maway's favor. Now, setting him up. Maway of the highway. That's all she wrote for Tommy Chong. Now, all he has to do is make the cover. Hook of the leg! One, One two, two, and three! three. Cheech and Chong have been eliminated from contention! Thanks in part to Lamont Sanford! My way has survived! They will be a part of Tag Team Turmoil! But again, you the fans will decide if they're in the match. Oh, great. More cheesy one-liners from Horatio Kane. But besides all that, the big news is that the Lethal Lottery Battle Royal will be making a return. We haven't had that since Episode 3. More than likely, you will get the news before the next edition of Heat Wave, as here comes Lionel. I don't have him on my format. But what I do remember is he did make a challenge to David Copperfield to settle this feud once and for all because basically Copperfield cost him a chance to go for the Eurocontinental Championship by appearing and then disappearing 
in that match against Alan Wake. Oh, he's making no bones about it. Will Copperfield accept? Oh, looks like we might have our answer very shortly. Here comes the Mad Magician himself. He's taking madness to a whole nother level with Lionel. After basically getting himself disqualified by walloping the Lord of the Thundercats with a steel chair at Ultimate Jeopardy. As mentioned, he did his he pulled out more tricks in his from his magic book and basically cost Lionel a match against Alan Wake on throwdown. That prompted Lionel to throw out the challenge to Copperfield one-on-one -on -one for Vandemonium. Let's hear what Copperfield's decision is going to be. It looks like he wants to go right now. Uh-oh. Here comes the commish. And he ain't coming out with no pyro. Oh, the commish power walking all the way down to the ring. This isn't like him. I guess he realizes this this rivalry between these two has gone on far enough. Wow! A blockbuster announcement! Copperfield and Lionel at Pandemonium! The winner! Gets a shot at the FBA's championship at total elimination.